Hey guys, have you ever made a decision that came from your gut, from your intuition, from your heart, where you felt afterwards, why did I do that? Why did my intuition tell me that? Um, was it the wrong decision? Like you're questioning yourself if you made the right decision and you're questioning whether or not it was your gut telling you that or your intuition telling you what you should do in that situation. So I want you to remember whenever you have that, whenever you're questioning yourself, whenever you, <clears throat> you're questioning your intuition, remember that at any moment in time, you have an infinite amount of choices. And so does everybody else on this planet. So you could have made a decision that was based on your gut and another person could have done the same thing. However, you have expected the outcome to be in a different way. So was it necessarily a wrong decision? No, it was just an outcome that you didn't expect, whether or not you could influence it or not, right? And also remember that we are living in a world of infinite possibilities. That means us as humans, we dictate our choices. And at the same time, we have infinite possibilities and choices. So infinite things or scenarios or situations can happen at any given moment. And so your intuition at that moment in time was leading you to do what it was, what it, what it considered to be right for you at the time. However, you cannot influence another person's reaction towards your decision, and you cannot influence what the other person is going to do after you have made your decision. So you may not ha have expected the outcome, but you still made the right decision. Doesn't mean your intuition is wrong. And who's to say what is right and what is wrong? We can have an endless discussion about that, right? We can say. You know something is wrong for somebody and but this is right for somebody else so what is wrong or what is right and then you must be honest with yourself when you ask your intuition about the decision that you made at that point in time ask yourself was this for my highest good after all can you see the lesson yet of why your intuition chose to guide you the way that it did can you see the lesson yet can you see what you were meant to take away from that situation? Can you see what you were meant to take away? The learnings, the lesson that you were meant to take away from what you did or what happened after your decision? Can you see that? If the answer is yes, fantastic. <laughs> if the answer is like, oh my God, no, I cannot see it yet. I have no clue why my intuition let me to do that. Totally fine. <laughs> You can just trust and surrender that eventually you will know the lesson. Because, right, sometimes we just find out the lessons years later. That's the sad part of life. But <laughs> it's just something that happens. And obviously, it is totally fine. But you will absolutely learn it. So what I want you to remember is also that when you're saying you're trusting your intuition and you're doing that and you're acting on your intuition, that... Do not lose trust or faith or hope in your intuition and you making the right decisions. Because when you set the intention before making a decision that it is supposed to be for your highest good, you will always make the right decision. Always. If you set the intention for what is the most fun, different outcome, right? <laughs> may not be for your highest good, but may be for the most fun. If you set the intention for that highest good for you and for everyone surrounding you, fantastic. But if you set an intention of, hmm, let's say, let's make it extreme and let's say set the intention of, I want to be right or I just want my ego to be, you know, satisfied, whether you do that consciously or unconsciously, hmm. <laughs> you'll, you know, the outcome may not be in your favor because obviously, in life, we're all supposed to lead from love, from your heart, from our intuition, from our guts. So I hope this video was helpful for you. Uh, let me know in the comments if it was. And I love and appreciate you.